What's up guys, we are here in Idaho and as usual, there's problems. We just got to the lake house. This was all flooded. It's this so flooded wet. all into here. Our light is raining. The ceiling is leaking all over there. None of our vehicles work right now, so we're gonna have to just order in some breakfast. Hey bud, you hungry? Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right, we're gonna order us some breakfast. And I've gotta go hook up some battery chargers to some vehicles because nothing's working right now. You wanna say something? No. You want to just say hi? Hi. <laughs> All right, so there's the Jeep. I went ahead and took the battery out because it's dead. We did have a trickle charger on it, but that apparently didn't work. We also had a trickle charger on the slingshot, but that didn't work, so I got a charger. I'm gonna go ahead and set that up on here, and I'm gonna go ahead and charge this up, um, see if we can charge the batteries, and if we can get something working, we can uh, replace both of these batteries. Hopefully they just need charge, but I'm guessing since they've been sitting so long, because we're not always here, I probably need to replace the batteries, so we'll see how that goes. It just might work. All right, so John has tried jump-starting both the slingshot and the Jeep with no luck, so now we We've got to figure out a different way to get the battery replaced so that we can get going somewhere. Hello. No. Hey, I got a all right guys so the electric scooter that he just dropped off is my new motorcycle it's a eora knight m1ps but it does say scooter so technically i guess it's an electric scooter it just looks like a motorcycle so i'm gonna get this thing to put together that way i can get a new battery for this thing and then when that gets working i can go ahead and take the battery that's still just sitting over here on the floor and get it replaced so that way i can take the jeep because right now we're all just stuck Back at home, we're gonna start off with a two wheel vehicle, work our way up to three wheels, and then four so we can take a whole family wherever we wanna go. So let's open this up and see what's inside. All right, so I pulled out what I could, but this is how much I can show you of the bike. I've gotta pull it out of the box, but unfortunately I need more than one hand to pull it out of the box, so I've gotta put the camera up, and then I can use both hands to grab this thing, pick it up out of the box, and then I'm gonna rip the plastic off, and then I'll show you. Five hours later. All right, here it is. This thing looks like it's gonna be a lot of Fun. I think it was heavy lifting out of the box, let me tell you. But I think that tire's got some issues, so I gotta put that on right. All right, so this thing's looking pretty sweet. I think all I've got left to do is put the foot pegs on and then I'll be ready to ride. That's my two wheel vehicle. That's gonna fix my three wheel vehicle. That's gonna fix my four wheel vehicle. I always have problems when I come to this house, I swear. All right, we've got it all, the pegs ready to go. I just have to open the garage door and I can take this thing for a ride. So I'm gonna go grab Cassie so she can film. Maybe grab the uh, drone and we'll see how it goes. I changed my mind. I'm gonna let this thing charge up because the battery is dead and I'm probably not gonna make it very far. Again, this is the Eora 4000 watt Chrome M1PS that can go up to 50 miles an hour and with its 72 volt battery, it can go up to 75 miles on a charge. What's up? My drone stopped. All right, drone, follow me. All right, apparently I was going too fast for the drone. So we're gonna keep it under 15 here. And if you're interested, I've got a link down in the description with an awesome discount for you. All right, 15 miles an hour is fun and all, but I need to get this drone back so I can bump this thing into full speed. All right, so after taking this out for a ride and seeing how easy it is, I decided to go ahead and invite my brother over who has not ridden a motorcycle before, and we're gonna see if he can ride this and see how he likes it. All right, so this is Justin. He's been in some of my other videos. Hey guys. I've already got it turned on for you. You're in second speed, so you can go up to 30 miles an hour. But your gas is twisting at, signals. There's your horn right there. And uh, I think you're good to go. It's probably in park. <laughs> yeah, it's in park. So uh, hit the brake and mode right here. Okay, and you're good to go. All right, don't crash. <laughs> so, obviously unlike a normal motorcycle, it's very quiet and it weighs a lot less and basically all the weight is in the battery at the bottom. So it's very good center of balance, center of gravity, whatever it's called. Okay, here he's coming back. 
All right, there he is. All right, so what'd you think of your first ride on an electric motorcycle? I guess it was pretty good. Easy, easy enough. Didn't crash, so it was pretty Nice good. and smooth. All right, so I'm actually gonna go ahead and take this thing back inside the garage because they also sent me uh, a larger seat. So if I wanna go on a longer ride, it's a lot more comfy for me, as well as a back seat so I can give kids rides and then uh, some saddlebags. So if I need to go to the store and get some stuff, I can go at the store and get some stuff. All right, John was able to take the motorcycle out and get the battery for the slingshot. So we've got the slingshot working, but the battery for the Jeep is too big to take on the motorcycle. So we're gonna take the slingshot and go get a battery for the Jeep. slingshot and a battery for the Jeep so now we can go places. Look at that, man, fancy steps. All right, so uh, before we can go anywhere though, all the kids want to ride, but I don't have helmets here for them, so we're just gonna give them a ride around the uh, driveway. Safety first. And then I'm gonna take the bike out and go for a long ride myself. All right, we've got another rider. He's ready. He's ready. Right, Jump up there. Think you can get up there? Here, ready? Come here. Ready? Jump up. Ugh. Woo! Woo. Oh. <laughs> Look at how happy okay. he is. What? What? Oh, he knows what to yeah, do. Yeah, he loves, okay? Oh, yeah. Yay! You ready? Yeah. All right. Mom, Love you, bud. Bye, yeah. Say bye. Bye. See you later. See you, See you later, later, alligator. Yeah. Woo! He loves this thing. Look at him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, ah! oh, Look at you. Do you feel like such a cool dude? What do you think, bud? Wow. Huh? What do you think? Dead. Good, he's so happy. Tell him what you thought. What'd you think? Did dad go fast? Was it really cool? Yeah. Check yeah. faster. No. <laughs> when you guys were out driving, Preston kept asking, when is it gonna be my turn? When are they coming back? I really wanna ride on the motorcycle. Yeah, you really love it, don't yeah, you? I like this thing. It's fun. You need another ride on medium Please? speed? Yeah. All right, hold on tight. I want to go through the grass because he rides his, uh, the cyber quad in the grass, huh? I was worried about the And it was really bumpy. Yeah. All right. So we got Madison on here. Hi. We're just going to go for a little drive around the uh, driveway. Okay, Madison? Okay. Sound good? Okay. Woo, let's go! How was it? Pretty nice? Yeah. And it's so quiet. It is. All right, who's next? Mm. All right. If anyone has a preteen, this is how you get loves. You got to hold around <laughs> me, Trin. You got to hold around me, Trin. Hold around his, yes. Give me big loves. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I'd say she's enjoying it. Maybe. Like Dad said. Best way to get loves. Ah! Now I'm gonna jump off and we're gonna let Jun ride. <laughs> okay, not really. 
Uh, I think all jumped off. But I'm gonna go ahead and go for a ride. So I'm gonna switch glasses so I got my camera glasses on. And since the Jeep is not working, I'm actually gonna have them help me film. So if they'll open their door back up, they can take the camera. Oh, Trin, yes. you're gonna be my videographer. You film me on the bike, okay? Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> All right. We'll see how they do. What took you guys so long? We're very fast. <laughs> just in the wind. All right, should we take the Jeep somewhere now? Yes. Now, since batteries are working, we're gonna take the Jeep. Today, I have got the worst headache, and I can't get rid of it because the kids are so noisy. You guys have probably all played the quiet game. The last person to make a noise wins, but everyone makes a noise, so nobody ever wins that game. We're gonna try a new version of the quiet game. Last to leave their room wins. So let's go tell the kids we got this cool challenge, and maybe then I can get rid of my headache. All right, today we're gonna do a challenge, Trin. Mm -hmm. Last to leave their room wins. But mm -hmm. here's the thing. You get your phone, but it's only to record you. You don't get to play games or call friends or any of that. You don't get your TV remote. You don't get your tablet. But you can grab whatever you else you want from the house. How long do we have to grab stuff? Two minutes. Go! Madison. Hi. You're playing last to leave the room wins. Which you room? have to take your phone because you have to record yourself. Which room? Your room. Oh. Hey, wait, wait. I got to tell you guys the rules. You have to take your phone. You got to record yourself. You know how to record, right? You don't get your TV. Uh, you don't get your tablet. You get two minutes to gather whatever else you want for your room. Ready? Nintendo. No electronics besides your phone to record yourself. I need a laundry basket to carry everything. I thought you were going to go some chips. You need to I record what you're basket. doing. Hey. Hey. What I need the a laundry basket. <laughs> <laughs> got myself a pink drink because those are delicious. Sugar. I just grabbed a whole box of sugar. What can we find in here? Nothing. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm getting something. Hey, remember, you don't look at your phone when you're on the stairs, okay? Don't need to fall down the stairs. <laughs> See, look at that, I almost fell. Hopefully I only have another two minutes and then it should be quiet in the rest oh. of the house. Out of my way! Um, 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 um. Ooh, there is one thing I can do. Wings <laughs> firebook. I'm gonna get myself a candy. I'm gonna grab my balance beam so I can practice my gymnastics for my competition. Time is up, Trin. You either go to your room now or I'm taking your stuff. I have to go to my room, I have to go to my room. Let's quickly run this to Trin. I brought you a snack. Don't ask where I found that. Bye, good luck. My sister just brought me this. You sure how to do that? Is that all you need is blanket and buddy? Yeah. All right, love you. Okay, bye. So Trinity has been wanting to do this video for a little while now. She was trying to plan it all out herself. Preston, when I was upstairs cleaning, came up to me and says, Mom, we're gonna do a video. 24 hours challenge in our room. So he's very excited about it. So we'll see how he does. They're all in the rooms. Listen. Do you hear that? We never hear this in our house. This is crazy. I don't know how long this is going to last, but if we were playing the quiet game, it would have already been over. We didn't even say you win anything. So you didn't have to give the winner anything. You just say you win, congrats. Yay! We're just gonna lay down and take a nap. All right, we have officially started the challenge. I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff I got. Some wrist crackers. Cosmo Brown and Candy Hearts. See, here we all. We got like a shower and a bathtub, entertainment, a bed, clothes, toys. Like who needs to leave this room? So everyone, this is my tool. So you see, this is my tool. Is this Bowser? Oh my gosh, you guys. Look. Yeah, my room, it's a outside garage. I was just, oh. 
my rings. One thing my dad forgot about is my secret candy stash. <gasps> oh, and I also have this giant pile of Squishmallows. Me, Madison, and Brendan all have our own bathrooms. So if we need to go to the bathroom, we can just get up and use it. A few moments later. Guys, I just ran out of toilet paper. What do I do? <laughs> no, you should have thought about getting toilet paper when you had your two minutes. <laughs> so apparently Trin doesn't have toilet paper in her room. That's going to be an issue. Guys, I just announced to my dad like three times. And he said, you should have thought about getting toilet paper when you had your two minutes. I am on the toilet right now. Can you just bring me some toilet paper? <laughs> Mom might. But I'm not going to. She wanted to play this game. She gets to play this game. I can't cheat and help her. All right, I'll be nice and bring her some toilet paper. Okay, guys, my dad wasn't much of a help, but my mom just brought me some. Thank you. Let's see how the other two are doing. What do you have? There's two spiders. Two spiders and a skeleton boy. Are you having so much fun playing in here? Well, is it 24 hours? Not yet. Send this to a music teacher to annoy them. <laughs> Alright, let's check on Madison. Hi! I heard you playing. Yeah, I was doing stuff. Oh, doing stuff. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so I just remembered Preston has a baby monitor in his room. So I'm not sure how well he will do with recording himself, but we can watch him and see how he's doing. Playing with his Legos. Meet Barry. Look at us, you just take some selfies here. All right, I'm gonna take a break for a little bit and read some Wings of Fire. So how's it going over there? Oh, it's going good. I don't get to sit down on the couch very often. All right, so on a scale of one being the quiet game to 10, how good is this going so far? Well, this is a 10. Way better than the quiet game. Parents, if you want some peace and quiet, this is an awesome game for your kids. <laughs> This is gonna be our new thing every week. All right, guys, I just read an entire chapter of that book. <sighs> I have no clue what to do. Oh, I have a riddle for you guys. If soap falls on the ground, is the soap dirty or is the floor clean? My snake. There she is. She's so pretty. Okay, guys, I just put my hair up in a really ugly bun. Do you like my necklace? Bonana. The snake. According to science, if you subscribe and like, you are 20% smarter than most people. It's totally off of science. It's not like I just came up with that. All right, it has been a bit, so let's check on these kiddos. So far, everybody's doing really good. No one has left their room yet, so let's peek in on Preston. How's it going, bud? What are you doing in here? <laughs> Building Legos? This dude loves Legos. He got this Lego table for Christmas, and he is taking full advantage of it, huh? I was just doing handstands against the wall. You were about to smash me. Whoa, <laughs> we got some mood lighting going on. Ooh, it smells very good in here. Oh, yes, that is why. Back. She brought her little oil diffuser back in. All right, don't leave your room. I'm gonna leave my room! That guy is kind of weird. This one is one of my favorites. Look at that. Let's check on Maddie. Hello. Hello. What are you doing now? Showing them my Pokemon cards. Pokemon cards? Yeah, the really cool ones, because I have a ton. So why did we have Cosmic Brownies? I got those today with my grocery order, which is very convenient and nice, by the way. I just ordered groceries, and the guy just dropped them off about a half an hour ago, so I didn't have to leave the house. You didn't get bread. Are you sure? I was supposed to order some bread. Uh-oh. The one thing I wanted. Survive on Cocoa Pebbles and Conversation Hearts. Okay. Mm. I do gymnastics, which I think you know that, but most of you probably don't know that I do competition. I'm gonna show you my beam routine. Go down into my lever, and I walk a little step, I get down, turns my least favorite part. Jump. Corn is my favorite slime. There's all the beads in it. Uh, it makes like a great texture. So this is my very first medal that I ever got from the judges cup. My favorite medal. Second place on bars. It's glittery. Like just look at how pretty that is. Winner's cup. Madison, so far nobody has lost the challenge, Madison. No, so you, you're not gonna lose? No, because you can live in here. There's a bed, there's entertainment, there's food, infinite water, a bathtub. 
tub, a toilet, clothes. Infinite water. <laughs> How's this little fella? This is my Halloween decoration. That's your Halloween? What is that? Skeleton? Yeah. I like that. That's pretty cool. How many more minutes? I don't know how many more minutes. You just have to stay in here longer than the girl stay in their room. Can you stay in the longest? Are you staying in your room too? Nope, I'm not. I'm staying downstairs. Mom lost because she can have her room. Yeah, Mom never wins the challenge. Shh. Loser. All right, bud. I'll see you later. Bye. And do when he dies. Come, come in. <laughs> What are you knocking on your door for? What did happen to your face? <laughs> I'm doing a face mask because yeah. I'm really bored. But I have a question. So my friend just called me uh -huh. and I answered and I said, just a second. No answering your phone. It's only for videos. It's against the rules. Do it again. You're out of the challenge. You understand? Okay, that's what I was asking. You understand? I answer calls. You understand? Okay. You gonna win this challenge, Shin? I don't think so. I'm already like wanting to get out. I like, please like play Roblox. I'll play, I'll play bid battles with you. Ugh, it's peeling off. Ew. All right. I'll play bid battles Our with you. Our face is peeling. We're going to leave. Okay. Uh, make sure you win the challenge, Trin. I'll play bid battles with you. Bye. Hey. we are going to just peel my whole face off at this point. This is not the satisfying peel that I wanted. It's on my eyebrow. Guys, it made my face bleed. Okay. I'm going to go wash this off. All right, Preston is calling for me. What's up, bud? I'm super hungry. You're super hungry? Yeah. You might need to just come downstairs and get your own snacks. No, Dad, I'm going to lose a challenge. And you're going to lose the challenge, but I see that you have a giant Oreo right there. And I did buy some new kind of Oreos. They're called Oreo Cakesters. You want to go get some? No. Tell Daddy what you was telling me. I want some snacks. He doesn't want to leave his room. You want some snacks? Yes. Oh, bud, your snacks are out here. If you want snacks, you're going to have to leave your room. I told him he could come out and come hang out with mom and dad and have treats, huh? There's lots of tra treats and snacks down here, but you'd have to leave your room and lose the challenge. <gasps> hey, you know the good thing about being out of the challenge? You get snacks and treats. All right. We're coming down. Hey, I'll see you down here in a little bit, bud. We're going to get ourselves some snacks, some treats. I told my son I'm the winner. Sure. That's why I'm the winner. Yay! All right, let's go tell Tintin. Tin. I'm the winner. Yeah, I think we know. He won. I'm the winner. Oh, you're a winner. Yay! All right, we're going to go get treats, huh? Yay for me. Not so much for him. You guys, something I didn't realize? I can talk to my sister, Madison, say hi really loud. Hello, did you not know you had an Alexa? Did Preston come to your room and say that he won? Yep. <laughs> Trinity! Did she just hang up? What happened? I'm the winner. You're the winner. Cause we get to have the treats. Ooh, but did you win the challenge? Yeah. Your first one, you win, high five. All right guys, Preston's the winner. And uh, with just one kid up, it's still pretty quiet. So we've decided that Preston's not the noisy one in the house, huh? Mm -hmm. Can I have a high five? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're a good one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's gonna be one of the two girls that's the noisy one in the house. We'll find out who's gonna be the winner of today's challenge. Me. I'm so bored. I just counted all of the tissues. There are 23. Now there's 22. I made a song. Waffle, waffle, get your waffle with cream syrup. Double waffle. What are you doing? Sing the waffle song, but it's waffles. Dad, do you want to hear the new waffle song? No, I want you to be bored alone in your room. Oh. I need to be able to go from the inside of your room to the inside of mine. What are we uh, corroborating here? Messaging system. Ah, are we trying to create a phone with two cups and a string? Trent, I have some violin strings. That won't work. Can you grab us the yarn from the cupboard, please? I don't know. I'll pay you a dollar to get me that yarn. You girls can just drop in no. each other's no, no, room. no, it's not no. working. It's not as fun. It's not working. Can you just get the yarn? You can just step out. It's like right here in this cupboard. I'll Look. pay you a dollar. I'll pay you five doll hairs. <laughs> I am being offered five dollars for Madison and a dollar from Trinity. Five buckaroos! Oh. I want my money. I brought some cups. Do you want some yarn? 
Yes. Yeah. Yard. Yeah, five dollars. Bro. Okay, never mind. We don't Bro, need it. Really we'll just take the cups. Okay. Bro, really far. Yay. Whoa, Trinity. If you want a cup, you better pay up. Here's a twenty dollar Target gift card. <laughs> Wait, did you say $20? I think it was worth it. All right, make good use of that cup. Okay, guys, I just lost a $20 Target gift card just to have the cups and string thing not work. Hello, Madison. Hello, Madison. This was a waste of money. Wait, no, friend. no! Ah! Oh, guys, I am about to die. There's nothing to do. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. <laughs> Madison isn't giving up, and neither am I. Hey, everyone. Oh! I'm going to put on as many shirts as I can. Hey, Mom. Come here. What? If you can guess how many shirts I'm wearing, I'll give you another gift card. <laughs> My child's bribing me with money. Are these all your shirts? Yes. You're gonna put them all back on their hanger, correct? Uh, you will. Okay. Guess how many? 20. Nope. I don't even know what I look like. <laughs> she looks like she gained 30 pounds. Yeah. Many hours later. Well, this has definitely been the most peaceful night we've had in a long time. Preston's just hanging out, eating some Doritos. We're watching some Bluey. Which, if you don't watch Bluey, other than like watching us, it's probably the best show out there. You guys, it's been like five hours. My head hurts. That's why I said, ow, hairs. Let's go talk to Trinity. Trin <laughs> Wait, do that again. <laughs> I'm out. You're out. Oh my god, yeah. you're out, girl. Wait, I just won the challenge. I just won the challenge. I don't have to be in my room anymore. So apparently, uh, the video's over. They were playing upstairs. Preston fell down. Look at that. Oh my goodness, buddy. Ouch. You okay, bud? We got a strong kid here. Didn't even cry, but that hurts. I did cry. You did cry? Yeah. Oh, and he made some little blood spots on Trin's blanket, bud. Anyways, mm. Trin and Madison are out of the rooms, so it's noisy. It's about eight o'clock at night. We started this at two or three. So it was a good five hours. Way better than any quiet game has ever lasted anybody in the history of quiet games. So this game is a 10 out of 10. We'll probably do this again next time because it was really nice having some peace and quiet. I don't know what's wrong with my kids. Today, me and Cassie have some work to do. This used to be where our TV was, but a couple weeks ago, we started a project and we're trying to make room for a bigger TV. But with these kids being super noisy and always in the way, it's really hard to get anything done. So if you guys saw our video a couple weeks ago, we had the girls and Preston all in their rooms to see who could be the last one in their room. And I think the winner ended up being Trinity. So this week, instead of last to leave their room, it's gonna be last to leave their bed, Madison. Yes, Madison thinks it's easy. I need to go tell Trin she's gonna be confined to her bed. S-L-E-E-P. Sleep. Madison's gonna sleep. Trinity and Preston, do you remember the video we did of last to leave your room? Yeah! We're gonna do it again! Yes, again! But this time, oh, no. you can't leave your bed. No, it's gonna be so small! I can't do anything! Preston, can you stay in your bed all day long uh, and win the challenge? Or are you gonna let a girl win again? You're gonna win? Yeah. All right. Trin, can you stay in your bed yeah, for 24 win. hours? I can totally win. No, it's gonna be so small! I can't do anything! How long do we have to get Forever. Stuff? To get stuff. Oh, to get stuff? The trend brings up a point. How long to get stuff? Obviously, they need some supplies if they're gonna hang out in the room all day. So, I don't know why you're still standing around because they should be gathering supplies right now. Pressing whatever you need to take to your room. Do you need a Gatorade? It's right there. Oh, uh, yeah, you better take that with you. And your ambulance. Oh, yeah, get some good stuff. Trim, got a laundry basket. All right, Madison's getting her backpack ready. Hard. Everybody's grabbing their phones so they can record themselves. Mom's gonna go ahead and help Preston because he needs to grab all his supplies, so she's gonna record him. All right, buddy. Let's grab your basket and fill it up. All right, what else are we getting? What's the Tootsie Rolls? 
I have to go to get my food. Okay, guys, I'm gonna get an Oreo Pop Tart. Those Oreo Pop Tarts are delicious. They're cookies and cream, but cookies and cream is the same as Oreo, right? Let's go, let's go, let's go. In here, we have the best thing ever. It grabs a bunch. My wall. Uh, let's do one licorice and all those Tootsie Rolls. Those look like a lot of Tootsie Rolls. <laughs> Yes! Um, we're gonna get my, 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 my. I have goldfish in my room. Trin over here loading up on some snacks. Oh, oh man, this is, oh, Trin may have taken everything good. It's a whole box it's never of cereal. Late for breakfast. Uh, if you guys don't know, Madison is obsessed with Cocoa Pebbles and is the only cereal she's eaten for the past two years. <laughs> and apparently it's the only thing she cares to eat today. If you put sweet pebbles in your mouth, you'll never have rocks in your head. Oh, a blanket. Oh, oh sir. One bowl. Oh, yeah. What was that? <laughs> Whoa. All right, grab your things, dude. Can you pee drinks? Guys, this is so hard. I have one hand to, to do stuff with. All right, I think that's about enough time. You guys got five more seconds to grab what you need and get to your room. All right, Madison already took off. Everyone else is leaving. Mom, I'm going to need you back downstairs, so hurry up. Let's go. TV. Um, if you have your remote with you, because once you get in your bed, you can't get out. All right, you guys, I have officially gotten to my bed. Hi, yes. Okay, guys, I'm gonna grab a few more things before I get to my room. I don't have any scrunchies, so I'm gonna grab like five. Well, guys, I'm in my bed. All right, and you make sure you stay in there, okay, buddy? All right, we'll get now or you lose the challenge. No way, Dad, I'm gonna win this challenge. All right, bud. Oh my gosh, I forgot the applesauce from my parents' room. If you guys haven't tried it, multi-grain flatbread crackers and applesauce, it's really good. Why are you not in this room? <laughs> You're supposed to be in your room already. <laughs> stay in your bed, get your feet off the carpet. And stay there. Okay. Forever. Okay. Don't touch the floor. The floor is lava, all right? So I can get on this and then the parkour over there? No, you gotta stay in your bed, <laughs> but also the floor is lava. All right, bye. Guys, look. I have a controller for my TV, blackers, two licorice, and a cheese stick, and it's rolls. And some of those stuff. I buy me DS. I have a towel and tape so I wash my face off. That's all. Guys, I already started. Okay, guys, I'm in my bed. I just had a pee drink, but I wonder if my dad will let me use my TV this time. Dad! Okay, guys, I just announced to my dad that he said I can use my TV remote. But anyways, I'll see you guys in like a couple minutes. I'm gonna watch some TV. All right, so for the real reason for the video, me and uh, Cassie get to work on this now. So the kids got their cameras. They're gonna go ahead and record themselves staying in their beds. We'll check on them every once in a while, but we're gonna go ahead and see if we can finish painting and putting the entertainment center together. And now that we've got the kids all taken care of, I decided I don't really wanna do this either. So I'm gonna let Cassie do it. I'm also gonna be competing in this challenge and I'm gonna go get in my bed. Wait, why am I doing this by myself? I have to compete. I have to be part of this video. I have to get in bed. Wait, why are we going outside? Bye. <laughs> All right, you guys. Like I said, I am going to compete in the challenge. I'm going to go get in my bed, but not in my comfy bed. I'm going outside. And I'm not going to get in that bed either. I'm going to get in that bed right there. If you guys didn't see my Cybertruck, I got a Cybertruck now. That's pretty cool. All right. Here we go. Oh. So now I'm in the Cybertruck bed. We're just gonna lay down and take a nap. <sighs> Except not really. I can't do this challenge because I've gotta help Cassie build that thing. But I just wanted to compete for a little bit. Also, I just needed the Cybertruck for my thumbnail. I lose today's challenge. So I closed up the bed of my truck and went back inside. Babe. Yes. 
<laughs> I lost the challenge. I couldn't stay in my truck bed for that long. Your truck bed? My truck bed. So I gotta come help you with some of this. All right, because I don't care to do it by myself. Yeah. All right, you guys. Gotta put the camera down and do some work. We got everything sanded and painted, and then we started bringing in the boards. And it was just then that we heard some noise coming from a fireplace. So I went outside to check it out. I didn't see anything on the fireplace, so I'm assuming two birds were just up there having a battle. And somebody won and they left. So I'm going back inside. I don't know, that was weird. Look at this. It's so crowded, I know, but it's so cute. Lip balm and re retainer. This is a light. This was fan mail, whoever, yes, it's like The best friend, the crown rings. Okay, you guys, I was just watching some YouTube shorts like right here, but I cannot find any good shorts. I'm getting so bored. Gummy bear ring, but if you turn it this way, it looks like a bunny. Best friend necklace. I have no clue what to do. I'm probably gonna take a nap. These are my nunchucks. I'm so bored. What are you doing, Trin? Just watching TV. All right, I don't know about that. Food will be here shortly. Yay! Guys, I wonder what food I got. <laughs> All right, stop eating that. Food will be here shortly. Yay! Later. All right, lunch is here. Let's give the kids their food. There's only one way to open your DoorDash food. You gotta be like the Martin Sharp, you guys. You gotta do it. If you don't do it, you're opening your DoorDash wrong. Trinity, I bring you food. <gasps> All right, so I got you a Happy Meal and I got this blue drink. This blue drink. It's pretty good. Eat it, don't make a mess. Yay. One down, two to go. Okay, you guys, my dad just got me a Happy Meal from McDonald's along with a blue raspberry slushy. So good. I'm like, he even remembered to bring me food. Madison. <laughs> McDonald's. Madison Donald's. How about you this thing? I don't know what it is. Well, it tastes pretty good. Put it there. All right, here's your table. Here you go. Don't make a mess. Okay, thanks. Okay, let's eat. All right, one kid to go. Anyone hungry in here? Me? You? I got you some McDonald's. Do you like McDonald's food? Yeah. What do you like meal from McDonald's? Happy Meal and Power Milk. That's right, Happy Meal and Power Milk. All right. Guys, can I you... need a book. Good job, buddy. Okay, can you eat it and not make I'm, a mess? I'm watching Homeless Dave. Homeless Dave? Oh my goodness, this is where he wins a million dollars, huh? Yeah. All right, can you not make a mess? Okay. High five? Love ya. Love ya. Okay, bye. Bye. You're doing pretty good. So far, you're tied for first place right now. I am not getting out of my bed. I didn't come to play. I came to win. Bye. Bye. Oh, I think this is like a slushy. I'm not sure. Ugh. I like blue slushies better. They should have gotten me a six piece. It's so sad. But hey, I can make two sandwiches with it. I'm good. You guys, McDonald's is the worst at packing french fries in their Happy Meals. This is what it looks like. Like what? They're not even in the package. They're supposed to be in there, not on the floor. McDonald's, if you're watching this, please fix it. I need someone to open this for me. <laughs> because every time I do it, oh, it actually didn't do it. It would always splat on me. Thank you. The packet of apples is open. McDonald's, how much effort are you putting into my having meal? This is how to make a chicken nugget sandwich. First, you need two chicken nuggets, three to four long french fries. Put them all together. You're gonna put them on the chicken nugget. Then put the other chicken nugget on top. Eat all the extra french fry. And then you can eat it like this, or you can dip it in any, like, thing. A chicken nugget sandwich. Mmm. You guys, these chicken nuggets just taste like feet. All I'm eating is french fries and a slushie now. 
Okay, so you guys, if you don't already know, I'm a Pokemon card collector, kind of. And I'm the McDonald's Happy Meal here. We have stickers. I've always wanted this little green guy. He's so cute. All right, who's our first one? I have a lot of him. I got this girl. So much. Oh my god! Oh my god! These guys, they're so cute. I've never gotten this. And then this is my second one of him. Quaxley. Finally, I've been needing Quaxley because I have the big version of Quaxley. This guy's cool. He looks like a dinosaur. Um, his name is Six. Lizard, and then we've got Fiddle, Kilo Waterall, My parents brought me chocolate milk because I didn't like the other drink. Tell me in the comments, do you guys like the red, like cherry slushies, or blue raspberry blue slushies? Well, you guys, I'm getting bored, so I'm gonna watch TV. Bye! I'll see you in a bit. You guys, I am so bored. I have no clue what to do. I finished eating my one star McDonald's. So McDonald's, be uh. better. I really want to like go do something. I want to go outside. <gasps> I want to jump on a trampoline. I want to go get my nails done. I've been wanting to get my nails done forever, but I couldn't because of gymnastics competition, but I finally can and look how boring they are. Uh, I think I might actually lose this challenge. I'm getting really bored even though I have my TV. All right, well, I finished my food and Cassie's finishing her food, but I'm gonna check on the kids because Cassie says she checked on Preston's uh, toddler monitor and he's just watching TV. And the girls, I think, are both watching TV as well. So if that's the case, we're gonna change things up a little bit. Trinity, what are you doing in here? Hmm? Watching TV. All right, new thing. Let me see this. Yeah. Let me see this. Let me see it. Okay. We're gonna go like this. No, no, no! And then we're gonna go like this. And then well, we're gonna go I'm like this. <laughs> Madison. Oh no. Are you guys seriously they are both watching shorts? We're uh gonna change things up a little bit here. We're gonna go like this. No! no. We're gonna go like this. Oh I can't <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go like this. All right, now for Preston. Preston, look at you. What are you doing in here? Oh. You turned the TV off and instead you're watching it on here? Well, guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna go like this. We're gonna go like this. We're gonna go like this. And guess what time it is? What? Nap time. Lay down. All right, I'm gonna turn your lights off and close these, okay? We're gonna just take a little nap, okay? okay. All right, love you. Love you. Okay, good night, buddy. Good night. Good night. The next hour and a half of this video should be very easy for Preston. The girls, though, without their TVs, not so much. You guys, my dad took my TV remote and I have no clue what to do. What do I do? Oh, I'm so bored. I'm just laying in bed, chewing some gum, because there's absolutely nothing to do. I'm bored. If I was sleeping, I would win this challenge. Last time I won, but someone else is gonna win this time because I'm out, or at least I wanna be out. I wonder what Preston's doing, because dad took everyone's controller. Guys, I'm gonna break out pretty soon. I'm so bored. <sighs> I think next time my dad comes in to check on me, I'm gonna leave. I'm so done. I just wanna go sit on the couch. You know what guys, I am just getting so bored that I don't care. We're going off bed. I have officially lost this challenge. I was just so bored, I am not gonna put up with that anymore. Oh no, I'm in the lava. I'm gonna go get Bristol. Hey, guess what, buddy? What? You won. I'm the winner. You won the challenge. Yay! Aw. Come on, let's go get that. Or do you want to keep napping? I don't want to keep napping. Come on, oh. Omish. Yeah, get out of that bed. All right, so you guys already saw Trinity was the first one out of the challenge, and then Madison lost. So the winner right here 
Little Preston, bud. Winner! Bud, did you know you're the winner? Yeah. Yeah? Who's the best? Me. Yeah. And then Trini was like, Yeah, hey guys, I'm the best. And then Preston was like, Uh, Trini, I beat you in my sleep. All right, guys, I do think the staying in their room as long as possible worked better, though, because they stayed in there twice as long as they did today staying in their bed. So I think the kids need a little bit of wiggle room, right, Madison? Yes. Yeah. So today we are back in Idaho, and we are going to have a challenge to see who can be the best bowler. We're going to play the person with the highest score wins. $1,000. Anyways, before we do that, on our way here, Preston was super sick. I think he must have ate something bad at daycare because on the plane ride, he threw up. And then, last night, he threw up, I think, like three times in the middle of the night. So he just got done taking a bath. Do you feel better? No. Still not very good? No. Did you throw up last night? Yeah. Yeah? Was it yucky? Yeah. Did you get rest? Where else did you throw up? On the airplane? No. Yeah. No. <laughs> Alright, but so what are we gonna do today? You know what we're doing with cousins? Yeah. What are we doing? Bowling. Bowling? You can be good? Yeah. Okay, I have five. <laughs> Alright, so we're doing that later today. Hopefully he feels good enough to go do bowling. But I did get this package delivered. Ugh. I'll show you guys here. You can see there's a steering wheel. And as you can see, our Ridge Racer game is not out with the rest of the games because somebody <laughs> broke this steering wheel. See how wobbly that is? So Ridge Racer usually goes right here on the end, but I think someone probably was yanking on the steering wheel too much, pulled it down, smacked the steering wheel. So the inside of that, I'll show you when we get taken apart. It's all busted up. So I had to buy a new steering wheel. We also had to get it last time I came. I had to put a new foot pedal because probably from the same incident, it probably dropped on those and busted the pedals. This is why I can't have nice things. But I got new pedals for it last time and then we turned on the game, tried playing it, and we realized this was busted, took it all apart, and saw that we needed a new steering wheel. So that's my project for before board. All right, so that was super simple. It was literally four screws, two on each side to take that off. But I did take the back off of this just to show you guys. This is the busted piece. So I think it fell. The steering wheel smashed this thing up. So. Don't need that one no more. So we got this one, which doesn't have it smashed in. So now I gotta just hook up these cords, screw that on, and we're good to go. Just like that, trains off to the races. Woo! You're gonna crash. All right. I'm gonna be such a good driver. Let's see, position 13. I'm totally gonna get my driver's license. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now smash into a wall, Trin. <laughs> nah. You can try again. You can do it next time. Obviously, she needs some practice. After this, I need you to come out to the garage with me, all right? Okay? Okay. Okay. All right, to the garage. Jump on a bike and go for a ride. Um, no way. Have you seen outside? It's freezing! There's snow! Way too cold for a bike ride! I'm going back inside! Have fun on your bike ride! Alright, so apparently we're not gonna ride bikes outside. But Yeasel Fitness did send me an electric bike. And once I set it up inside, we can ride a bike inside where it's warm. Alright guys, it's coming together pretty good. There's the bike so far. But I still have these extra pieces and that huge TV to put on it. But first, we've gotta go bowling. So this thing has to take a break. So let's go bowling, see who the winner is, give them a thousand bucks for winning, and then come back and finish this bike. Also, make sure you check out the very end of this video because I've got something back at home that we've got to show you from our last plane trip, and it's disgusting. Me and Preston could have died. Like, seriously. All right, so we're just getting back uh, to the house uh, from jumping, but apparently the uh, post office guy did not like where I parked because he left me this. Don't block mailboxes. And then he wrote some choice words. I guess they get mail delivered here on the weekends. My bad. Just a sick world we're living in. So the bowling thing didn't work. The uh, jumping for as long as you can didn't work. So instead, you're gonna come for as long as you can. Are you gonna win this challenge, bud? All right. 
he's still not feeling that great. So I'm going to grab some food and then we're going to go. We've already been eating, but let me show you our first bite. So I got a little bit of everything. Cassie got a little bit of something. Preston's over here eating some noodles. What's the best thing so far? Mama's noodles. Mountain Dew. He likes Mama's noodles. And then the girls are over there somewhere. I don't know. <laughs> Cassie's got like a piece of bread and I have like one of these sticky buns left. We're almost done with our first plate. Preston's on a second plate, but not doing very much. Madison, why are you dancing? You haven't even touched your food. You're going to be out of the challenge before you start. Challenge. Yeah, Trinity. It's last to, to stop eating wins a thousand dollars. Last to stop eating wins a thousand dollars. And you haven't started. Oh, hey. Yeah, yeah. don't stop eating. But look at what I got. Does that look delicious or what? You want some of that? What? You want Jello? No, no, no. All right, guys. So Preston's not feeling good. So I'm gonna eat a good sandwich. It's got cream and a vanilla wafer and covered colored marshmallows. You want to try that one? What? A few moments later. You eating dessert, Madison? I know, but you didn't even eat any food. Oh my food is cold. It's easy to get brain freeze when you have so little brains. Oh, that's gotta hurt. I'm done. Are you done? Yeah. Later. Alright, I still haven't had dessert yet, but I think that's my next plate, so let's go check on the girls. Their plates are full. You're not done? Nope. Alright, alright, Trin's not done. Madison? Hi. Are you not done? Huh? You're still not done? I'm All answering right. this for the thing. Oh, We're hey, guess what? Huh? Mom and Preston are out. I'm gonna win. Guys, I'm so full. I'm done. I'm out of the charge. Oh, I'm out too. You're out? I'm gonna win. Did I win? No. And the winner of my thousand dollars is me, so I don't have to pay anybody, but now I'm gonna be extra fat. Alright guys, so obviously I won the challenge, but we are back home now and we're gonna try out the inside bicycle because Trinity is a pansy and doesn't wanna go ride a bike in the snow. It's freezing! Alright, here's Trinity. She's my little guinea pig. Look at her running in her treadmill in her little exercise wheel. <laughs> so they do have the trainer like this, or you can also set it so you're just like going through the wilderness or just free ride, or you can even just like, I'm not gonna tell her, but uh, we'll show you a little bit later because there's other things that you can watch on the screen too. What do you think, Trin? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get Madison and see, see if she wants to have a ride on the bike. And also you guys, I will put a link in the description for the useful bike, so if you wanna get one. Click down there. All right, Madison's on her way down. <gasps> How you doing, Trin? I'm good. I just switched and now I'm in New Zealand. What? Oh. You're standing up? Crazy. Huh. Huh. All right, so here's another mode. You can just take a scenic uh, bike ride around different countries. And there's Madison. Not that, that. Hi. All right. Hey, look at the Trin's going on one foot. Trin's she cursed. thinks she's crazy. All right. Uh -huh. Madison, you want to try? Yeah. It's cursed. It's cursed? Yeah, so just Your look at that. Your sister or the bike? Uh, both of them. <laughs> just look at it. I mean, definitely this. Stop. Get off. Oh, I'm gonna leave them to that and I'll be right back. All right, so it looks like Trinity is down here trying to beat her high score of 13th place and she's not doing so well. <laughs> Madison, how you doing? You driving through New Zealand? Yeah, I can go fast. Yeah, what, what? What are you watching? I'm watching <laughs> me. All right, so. Subscribe. Madison's watching Gamer Madison. Subscribe. Subscribe to Gamer Madison. Oh wait, I think Trinity hit 100,000 subscribers. I might not be good at this game, but I am good at hitting 100,000 subscribers on my gaming channel. One eternity later. All right, it's been a while. Let's go check on the girls. What you girls doing? Watching TV. What? Watching. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, so the TV also can spin around and so you can just sit in your arcade and watch YouTube if you decide to do that. <laughs> This is an applesauce pack. This is also an applesauce pack. All right, so a couple weeks ago, we went on a plane trip and we got one of these like box meals and stuff that has all your stuff in it. 
And me and Preston got one of these apple sauces. And it was like this. And I was like, why is that full? Like, that's weird. It must have got packed with some extra air in it, right? So I give it to Preston and I'm like, oh, and I open it up. It didn't explode on me, but I'm like, here you go. He tries it and he's like, nope, not good. And I'm like, dude, it's the same as what we have at home, right? And so I'm like, here, just eat it. It's good. I thought it was just that it wasn't the apple cinnamon and we always have apple cinnamon. So I'm like, just try it. It's good. So he tries it again. Didn't like it at all. So I'm like, all right, fine. I'll eat it. So I went and took a big old swig slurp of that stuff. It was so nasty. And then we read on the back here and it says, keep out of reach of children under three. If pouch is damaged, inflated, or seal is broken, do not consume. So if you ever get one of these things that is like this, do not eat it. This is disgusting and gross. I don't know what's growing in here, but I'm probably gonna like open it up and cut it open and show you guys and see what's growing. Oh, and then yeah, we sealed it back up and when we got back, it was like this again. And then somebody else like opened it up to smell it. And then we closed it back up. It like, it keeps doing it. So there's some weird chemical reaction thing in these. I don't know what it is. They're good when they're like this, but if they're like this, don't drink them, huh bud? All right, we're gonna open it up. Hopefully this thing doesn't like blow up in my face. Oh, oh did you hear the air just really? You could hear it. It was kind of like when someone opens like a pop and it's like. All right. You should squirt it onto the plate. I'm going to squirt it on the plate. Oh. It just looks like liquidy applesauce. Yeah, but that was like a chunky chunk. I don't know. And this is what it looks like under the microscope. That's disgusting. I'm just kidding. This is just a random clip we found online. I guess it's fine. But Ugh. Ew, that oh, doesn't smell look good. Smell it, Trent. Does no. it smell good? Oh, no. Oh, uh, you can smell it. Here. We're going to videotape Mom smelling it. Smell it, Mom. How close do I have to get? Ugh, gross. You don't oh, even have to get close. That's like sour smell. That's nasty. Oh, my goodness. Was that all of it? Is it? Uh, uh, all right. You Ew. probably shouldn't even smell this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that is the story how me and Preston almost died. Today I've got a challenge for the girls and it starts off with our tiny house. We've got a ton of critters, mice and rats that we find over here every single day. Let me show you guys. So you see right here, that is a bunch of mouse droppings. We've got a cage set up here. Think back here. Yeah, there's another one set up right there. And then we've got more inside. So inside here, we normally got a cage in the back, a couple on the sides, come on there. The mice, the rats, whatever they are, they keep getting in this thing. The small ones crawl under here. The girls leave the doors open. The rats get in. We catch two or three mice every single day. So for today's challenge, we're going to be doing last to move wins. We're going to take these rats. I'm going to be standing with the cage with the rats in them. The girls and Preston are going to be standing around me. I'm going to let the rat go. The rats gonna run after someone and if they move they lose now this challenge is going to take us probably a week to do because we're gonna do a whole bunch of rats so each day we're gonna run out grab the rats let them go and see who's the bravest kid in my family so right now you guys can see look at this we've got this little uh, chinchilla looking rat over here and we've got this one over here yeah you I'm talking about you Preston is at daycare so he's not gonna get to go in the first one so I'm gonna grab the girls and we're gonna see who's the winner of round number one all right you guys so we're over here we're gonna let these go one more last look here at these little dudes. Do that. All right, girls, pick a spot, stand. I'm going to open these up. Okay. Mm, they're pointing at me. Whichever one of you girls moves, loses. Oh, you want to go? Okay. This one over here wants to go. Don't come in here. Go get my go get her. No, I moved. Okay. Day one was a fail. These girls scared the rats away. Mom didn't even jump. We gotta try out again tomorrow. All right, you guys, John just told me to hurry um, to the kitchen. He has something to show me. Look what I just found under our sink. What the? What? Oh! No! Need no! no! All right, I didn't really find another sink. We found it outside, but we were gonna take it through the house to go let it go, but now pee. <laughs> That's gross. I have to be careful because this guy is a little camera shy sometimes. He's like so excited to get out. He might come for you. I know. We're going to let him go oh. into that hole right there. Great right, mouse. Oh, he didn't go in a hole. Oh. All right. If he were to get us, we got rabies. What? We would get rabies. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm glad he didn't get us and give us rabies. All right. We are here across the street. What are we doing, Madison? Releasing rats. Okay. What do we got? All right. So now. Wow. He's. Little mouse dude. Little baby. Now we got the big dude. Dang. We got the mother. Hey, don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Oh, he's 
is ready. If it comes to me, I'm gonna run it. <laughs> Oh, oh, that way. All right, and the loser of today's challenge. Where's Trinity? Trinity. Well, yeah, because it was going to crawl on my foot. What if Madison was standing there? I would have waited. You would have let it crawl up your leg? Yeah. yeah. It's small. It's very cute. It was cute. I don't want to have ray bays. All right, guys. Day number two, we've got another small one and another giant rat. Dang, he's huge. All right. He looks like the... So, girls, get your places. Do not put that on me. Matt, no, Matt, you're me. She wants to do that in the lane. Just I don't. Right here, right here. Okay, don't move. No. Don't move. <laughs> <laughs> okay, take place. Come out. Go, go. Go, little baby. Aw. Come on, little fella. Come on. There you go. It's okay. No, you don't. Aw. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's huge. Oh, give me the Eevee Jeebies. Near me, I'm running. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy go. cow, he's huge! And the loser for the second day in a row It's Trinity. I can't do that He's terrible. He is huge. All right, so the shed has been a disaster, so I took everything out of it today, and I've got to clean all this up. You can see all these spots on the ground. This is where all the rats and bunnies go to the bathroom, especially over here. So I've got to clean all that up. And then we actually got four traps, and we're going to set all those traps inside and see if we can catch even more. So tomorrow, maybe we'll have four rats or mice or maybe bunnies to see if they can attack the girls. All right, I've got everything in. I've got the trap set. One, two, three, and four. Oh, also, you guys, in case you don't follow us on Instagram, if you don't, you should. It's trinitybeyond.yt, or you can search for Beyond Family. Anyways, we'll see you guys tomorrow for the next round of Last to Move wins. All right, guys, we didn't catch four, but we do have two little ones today, and we've got Preston. Let's give you a good spot, okay? Right here? And the goal is to not move. We're gonna let both of these guys go at the same time. No! Go there, you know, right. there. Right. They're gonna come Sorry. at Preston. Sorry. They're gonna come. Okay. Preston, the rats are gonna run at Maddie. Go over there. No, it's okay. If you, you go ready? over there, they won't get you. They're both open. Hurry up, I've got anti gymnastics. Just tip it over. Dump them out. Oh, oh here, here comes one. Preston, don't move. Seriously, don't move, Preston. Don't move. Preston, don't move. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Oh, oh, he came Alright, this little guy. Oh. It was gonna eat. That uh, crow <laughs> came right in. Oh, <laughs> he's watching, he's gonna eat it. Huh? Someone go scare it. Person, you wanna go run at that big bird? <laughs> oh, look, look. Get it, get it. Look. Oh, he's totally waiting for his food. All right, Preston lost today's challenge. The crow also lost today's meal. All right, so we're getting these set back up in here, but today we're gonna do something different, Madison. Dad, what are we doing different? All right, today, bud, we're gonna leave this door open. You know why? Because when we leave the door open, we don't do it on purpose, but the girls always do it because they don't know how to shut a door properly. That's when we get the big rats. So today we're gonna leave the door open all night and see if tomorrow we can catch two three or four big rats and maybe we'll get an even bigger crow to chase us tomorrow. Does that sound like fun? You want big rats? No. <laughs> that little mouse almost got you, huh? Alright, I'm going to make sure these are set up right and then we will see you guys tomorrow. Alright guys, it's the next day and we got a giant rat in here. But Trinity says there also might be a bunny in the shed, so let's go check that out. Officer Preston here says he's got the criminal. Where's she at? Let's go. Apparently, there's also a criminal in our backyard. Oh my goodness, that looks like a horrible criminal, bud. What do we gotta do with her? Put her in jail. In jail? Should we put her behind bars? Yeah. All right, we're gonna go ahead and put her behind bars, you guys. Now she's in jail. Wait, officer, you're in jail with her. Yeah. What are you doing? Hey, you're in jail. Or what? You're in jail. Look behind you, you're in jail. No, look, you're behind the bars. All right, let's uh, let's check the shed. There may be a bunny that hops out at us in here. There's not a bunny in the trap. That's the trap that we had the rat in. That trap's closed, but there's nothing. And that trap's in. Okay. Criminal did the search in anything? Nothing. Nothing? No. Nope. All right, let's go get the rat and the kids and see who it goes after today. All right, guys. What are you doing? Sissy. This rat is ready. <laughs> Do it to Sissy. It's very active. Some kid. All right. Do it to Sissy. Do it to Sissy. Oh, chip. Chip. We got, okay. We oh, the the kids brought a chip in the middle. <laughs> right. We're going to see who it goes to. The chip, Officer Preston, Masson, or Trin. Are you ready? Chip, chip, and... chip. No one's coming for me. Okay, here it goes. 
Okay, now. It wants dad, actually. Dad. Whoa! What? What? You're in right. the ship! Ow! Oh. scare oh. rats. <laughs> that was lame, hi! Huh? Hopefully, we have better luck with it tomorrow. Alright, this is the little mouse that we caught this morning. He's so cute. Yeah. He's so cute. He's under arrest. Should we take him across the street? Yep. Hi, little fella. He's so cute, huh? Yeah. He's so yeah. tiny. Okay, little mouse fell in the house. Hi! He went in the little hole. Do you think he's gonna stay in there, bud? You think that's a mouse hole? You think that's a. Oh, oh hi! He's like, no, this ain't my house. <laughs> so, bud, what happened at your doctor visit today? I took my throat. Did it look good? Or did it look not too good? Good. Good? What it looked like, Mom? He says it's the same size. <laughs> Still big tonsils. You got bigger tonsils than me, kid. <laughs> and you're little. <laughs> Everybody liked your uh, police outfit in the office, huh? Mom will let you wear the police outfit. That's the first thing the doctor talked about when he came in, huh? He saw your handcuffs and you're your walkie-talkie. <laughs> This is a police officer. The doctor's got to be good, or otherwise you will arrest him, huh? All right, we're back from our appointment, and this dude... Wait. Okay, ready, steady, go. What in the heck? And around the corner to the finish line. And he made it! I want my red balance spike. Your red balance... What about your new balance spike? There's Preston's new orange balance spike. It's electric. Yeah. All right, guys. So we've got Preston his new little outfit so he can ride his bike. Here, show him your outfit, bud. You like it? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Okay, ready? Yeah. Smash it down on your head. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. The face is in there somewhere. That squishes your cheeks a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! You like it? Yeah. Yeah? How fast are you going? Like eight miles per hour. I'm on the slowest speed. All right. Well, let's we'll see how your brother does. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Let's take everybody through this track we made. Just a little bit, baby. Woo! Just a little bit. You got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Woo. John took Madison and Preston to gymnastics. Trinity's upstairs in her room, and I've been outside putting away their bikes. But we have two traps in our shed. One of them is always catching stuff, mice. And then I just noticed that this other one is actually closed. I'm gonna wait to show you and tell you what's in this one until Trent comes out. All right, turn him around. Look at him! Hi! He's really cute. Hi! I don't know if he's scared or what. He's like not moving. I'm so sorry, dude. I forgot to shut the shed. All right, should we walk it across the street? Okay. There you go. Oh, he's so cute. Do not go on the road. No, no, no. No. Next one. We called this one a medium rare. <laughs> Hit. Madison, did you just run right in front of it? Yeah. <laughs> you want it? it oh. Hey, they never go straight out, Madison. Oh. Ever. So you should just scoot over. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, the lizard. Lizard. Ran lizard. It ran right where the lizard is. Look at that thing. Look at that lizard. All right, we got a little guy for Preston and Mom. Wait, I want to be with you. No, you run, Mom. You have to stay here with me, okay? But I never do it. Okay, here it comes. Next time, Ready? okay? Here it comes. <laughs> there he goes. And Mom didn't even. Move. I didn't even move. Who's winning so far? You? I don't know about I think that. Oh, Madison, isn't it? Yep. Maddie's winning. All right, we are walking across the street to release a couple of critters. The last couple times we had Preston. He is at daycare today, so today we are gonna release these ones with Madison and Trinity. Got a little guy? Oh, we got a big guy. Look at that thing. Dang. Trent, trade spots. Oh, they're going right out the middle. Madison. Trade spots. Yeah! <laughs> wow, he was quick. Oh, All right, maybe you guys need to step in and step. No, I'm good. Madison is so excited. Oh, I'm good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm 
good. All right, you ready, Trin? No. She is not happy. Go, get her. Get her. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> It was hopping. I told you it was like a bunny. <laughs> the big rats always go that this way. Girl the big rats do. The rat was gonna eat her. Look at that face. She's so scared of mouses. Got a little one today. Don't move, okay? We named it Timmy. 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 Timmy the minion. I like the bones. <laughs> Alright, we've got one more set of critters to see who can be the last girl standing. And then we've got something really cool to show the girls. Oh! We've got Chilla. They're huge. We've huh? got two more big old fat ones. No, that one is... more little one. Alright. Yeah. We're gonna walk these across the street, see who can be the last girl standing, and then we're coming back. We got three of them today, ladies. Your brother's missing out. Little fella. <laughs> Oh, right by you, Madison. Whoa, I know. They're pointing at me. The chinchilla or the chinchilla? Oh. <laughs> Come on, little fella. Whoa. Alright, now I got something to show these I'm kiddos. Huh? All of you. Let's go back home. Alright guys, so we don't always just catch mice. We did also catch a bunny. So see, there's this cute little fella. Hmm. So we are gonna let this thing go in our yard again because we love it when it poops all over the place. Come on, bud. Don't look like it. Come on. He's torching it to you. Oh, yeah. oh. Yeah. oh. All right. That is it for today's video. You guys tell us who you think won. I think Madison was the winner because Trinity and Preston ran away from all those Trinity, mice and give me rats. Your nails. And but my nails are amazing. I don't know what's going on with this. But I think Madison's the winner. You guys comment down give below who you think was the winner of today's <laughs> this week's challenge.